I love that. That's nice. And that was, he tells on the back where you're at. So. Mm -hmm. Thank you, yeah. Morgan, so she can see. See, that's where your grandpa Alma that's went. Grandpa. He, was, he was a teenager. <laughs> Kodiak. You were up in Kodiak, really? Wow, that's cold. That's, you know where Kodiak is? It's Alaska. Woo-hoo-hoo! -hoo. Yeah. He was in freezes in, in Hawaii for three years, Shosei. too. Oh, yeah? Yeah. So that's I see you were school cert, everything. Look at you. That's when you didn't have to have your tank. You didn't have to have that's a license to, uh, yeah. to uh, yeah. certify. I had to have a license. Huh? This must have been the 60s, right? Yeah. Right he well, went in when he was young. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is when he was in Honolulu These right here. Grandpa, <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. I bet you didn't have nobody stow away in, in the, uh, the wheel well there, huh? <laughs> P3s. Oh, my goodness. Look at you. See, this is you. Remember that? That was you. You were a you handsome old... young man, weren't you? You still are. <laughs> What's this? Uh, Midway. Oh my goodness. That's Midway right yeah. there. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay. I got him. I got him. Thank you for showing me those. Wait a minute. You this, have this is a certificate that we're going to give you. And uh, I'll let you take a look at it, but I'm going to. Uh, and it has United States Navy seal down here. Oh, Navy dog. <laughs> well, what I do, See, you're here for my service service. Yeah, absolutely. But I was 24 years also, you know, from my never old civil service. Civil service? You were civil yeah. service also? He was in customs. Okay. Federal smart old service. My son's doing that right now. He's, uh, he's getting vetted now. They're checking my background like there's no biz nobody's business right now. Yeah. And I didn't do anything. It took almost a year for me. Yeah. But it is. Yeah. And Eric, the problem with my son is everybody's overseas. Nobody in my family is born in the United States. We were all born in Japan, Korea, Germany. So they got to go to every place to do the background checks. So, ladies, I didn't introduce myself. I'm Wayne. How you doing? Your name is? Tell your name. Tell me your name. Sage. I'm Sage. Sage. Beth. Beth. Morgan. 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 Okay. Thank you and so much for your orange. All right. Yeah. Thank you, sir. The reason why I came today is because, on behalf of Cornerstone Hospice, we are level four uh, participant in the veterans. Uh, we are in a veterans program. Uh, well, well, we're in the hospice. Uh, we are in a veterans program. Um, we honor these veterans because during their time, no matter when it was World War One, World War Two. Korea, Vietnam, especially Vietnam, and uh, even today's times, uh, a lot of veterans were never honored or received anything. When they got out, they got out, and that's all it was. These young men that are getting out now are taking care far better Amen. than than we did when I was uh, in my son. <laughs> you want to march? All right. What we do is we present a certificate of appreciation. What was your What was your rate in the? Uh, Master Chief. Master Chief. Master Chief. Master Chief. E9. It was E9. All right. <laughs> this is a, from Cornerstone Hospice, a certificate of appreciation for Master Chief Omer Wilson for your service to our country, for your dedication and courage to keeping America free. We are grateful for, to you, your family, and say thank you. That's why we bring this here. This is a certificate. Let's say thank you. Thank you for serving. They're saying thank, thank you for you. serving. Vietnam now, and all the other services. I'm going to do see. one more. Th we're going to going to show you that at the same time. Um, this is the formal citation that we do, and this formal citation honors you for uh, your service, but also we give you the cornerstone pin, a salute pin, because these are coveted gems. Not many people get them, and I, in fact, just got my coin recently, and it's a picture of. The Screaming Eagle Can I see with the United States one. flag, Let's and it see. says Cornerstone Hospice on there. Yeah. It's very, very nice. Yeah. All right, uh, but we are we give that to you. Give it, show that to the camera. Let me turn that around for you. It looks just like our our uh, our uh, brand. See, Cornerstone Hospice actually goes that way. Mm -hmm. See that? Mm -hmm. It looks just like that emblem or the uh, seal there. 
But if you uh, would bear with me real quick, this is how we do it. No person was ever honored for what he or she received. Honor has always been a reward for what he or she has been given or have you that you've given. We are gathered here today to honor you for your service, the service you give to your country. My name is Wayne Smith. I'm United States Army, retired 23 years. Uh, you got me by two years, so that's a good thing. <laughs> and <clears throat> um, I'm retired, and it is my great honor and privilege to present to you the Cornerstone Salute Pen. With your permission, sir, I would like to pin you at this time with the Cornerstone Pen. Do I have your permission, sir? Permission granted? All right. Okay. All right. Hang on just a second. This pen signifies that you are a a valued member in the community with Cornerstone uh, Hospice. Also was an MR. Uh-oh. What's the MR? Make, uh, Master. I don't know. Radio uh, operator? What's A9. that? Yeah. Okay. D9. Okay. D9. Okay. D9. That's uh, me. Master could go. What, <laughs> what we called our Sergeant Major, you guys called the Master Chief. Yeah, right. Yeah. D5 to right around the end. Right. I was a American Honor, mm -hmm. Tabit Armament Humist. Mm -hmm. I am a Master Recarver. Master. Master Chief. Master Chief. Yeah. Okay. Aviation. Okay. Aviation. E Fate. Mm -hmm. Electronic Technician. All right. <laughs> so, if you're an electronics technician, I probably would have seen you if we served at the same time because when you fly in my area, so that first summer. Yeah, that's right. When I, when, if you fly in my area, I can reach out and touch you. Yes, sir. Even <laughs> if you go to space, I can get you in space. <laughs> that's what yes, I do. Sir. That's what I did when I was in the military. I could, I could go to uh, the Howard Ranch, mm -hmm. you know, up in Asia, mm -hmm. and be laid there if I want to be. Mm -hmm. Arlington. Uh -huh. Arlington. He's talking about Arlington. Okay, good. Well, let me finish this real quick, and then we can talk about that a little bit more. We want to thank you on behalf of a grateful nation, the staff and volunteers, all the Cornerstone Hospice personnel here, and the professionals, the College of Care, and the Hospice Veterans Partnership of Florida. would like to pay special tribute to you for your military service to America and for advancing the freedom of hope, the advancing hope of freedom and the liberty for us all. For your service, Master Chief Omer Wilson, I salute you. Thank you for your service. <laughs> All right. And that's what we do. You can take a picture of this uh, like this. Just like that. You like that? All right. You like that gold? I do too. Mm -hmm. However, listen, how long have you been married? Be 48 years yeah, next 48 years. Six years. <laughs> all right. You didn't do it all by yourself, did you? Perfect weapon. <laughs> you didn't do it all by yourself, right? I'm sorry. That's right. I had, my wife had to move my family 19 times while I was in active duty. 19 <laughs> times. <laughs> About 15 of them by herself. And I was deployed overseas, fighting, whatever I had to do. I was in charge of about 100 and something troops. And I know what it's like trying to move. However, I know for a fact. Yeah, it's hard to move. Exactly. I know what it's like to take hard care of you. Be, it's hard to be the right guy. Mm-hmm. And I know it's hard to feed you, keep your uniforms clean, take care of the house while you were gone. And for that reason, I want to honor your wife for her service mm -hmm. to a great veteran. Ma'am, would you stand over here? Oh, oh, <laughs> I'm your, you're the sister. I'm the sister. You're saying you let 48 you years. You I just let you in out the door. Hey, there's only one year different than us. Stand right over here. Yeah, it's fine. Nice. Um, if you yes. stand and turn this way a little bit so we can get you on the camera. Okay. All right. Ma'am, with your permission, I would like to pin you with the United States flag in honor of taking care of a great veteran for so many years. 48 years to be exact. Do I have your permission? Yes, sir. All right. I'm sorry I'm trying to marry your sister into the family. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. We know how hard it is to take care of a veteran, so we honor you for that. And for that, we salute you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right. <laughs> and that's what we do for, uh, um, for Cornerstone Hospice. We honor all veterans no matter what the setting, whether it's 100 people or whether it's an intimate setting like this. <clears throat> because we believe that every veteran needs to be thanked for their service. 
And it's a difficult life, but you did it. And I know how tough tough it was because I I'm, I I raised some hell devils. He's going <laughs> he knows what you're going through. Yeah, I raised uh, my son just retired recently, so I raised some devil dogs, and uh, they jumped off roofs in the house. And every time I came home, they had a broken leg or something. They thought I was killing my kids. I, I wasn't even there. <laughs> so I know what it's like, and uh, it's a tough life. And I en I enjoyed it. I would go back if they take me. But they, they won't take nobody this old. <laughs> they will not do it. And I would like to thank you all for being here with them while I'm doing this and for sharing this moment with them because it's just. Got this in the can. All right, Norton. Yeah. I got you. Thank you, guys. All right. Okay. Thank but you. Uh, I thank you for allowing me to come in and doing this, do this for you. If you would like, real quick, I would like to take a picture. If I could stand on that side mm -hmm. sure. and you stay on this side and everybody come over with cameras and take a picture. So that uh, you can have a picture.